Protandem Update, uh, August 2011. Uh, once again, Protandem, an exciting NERV2 activator, works on genes in terms of helping, uh, uh, once again, do gene manipulation down up to now maybe 4,000 genes in terms of up and down regulate, turn on and turn off genes like that, very, very important. So one of the conditions out there that, and also it reduces oxidative stress, uh, published in Free Radical Biology, uh, that from uh, uh, from, a, from an 80-year-old, or regardless how, down to a baby within 30 days. So oxidative stress is the root of all type of problems. So to explain that, what, COPD, chronic obstructive pulmonary disease, uh, one of the top five killers, devastating people suffocate, a lot of it's due to smoking, but air pollution and other types of uh, industrial type of things. COPT is bad news, and of course, there's no treatment there. Well, this was kind of interesting. This came out in Newsmax. COPD breakthroughs. Okay, well, most of them were drugs and said, but you know, there's a little place called John Hopkins Medical School, and they, that's what they're saying. An important understanding gained in COPD research is the correlation between the decline in the lungs' oxid oxidant defense system and the progression of OCOPD, oh my goodness. Because there's no drug, when well, they're trying to make drugs for that, and I just told you, Protanum is able to reduce that in 30 days down to a baby. So you think if you have COPD, that might help? Oh, but we can't make any connections there because only drug doctors can say we cure things, but that's right, they've never cured anybody. So scientists at John Hopkins uh, discovered the expression of a gene, NERF2, hmm, where we heard that before, significantly decrease in smokers with advanced COPD uh, compared to smokers without COPD. So this is, once again, COPD breakthroughs, yeah. And so protandum is a breakthrough. Another type of headline, same type of thing from John Hammond, experimental treatment for COPD in development. What are they talking about? Nerve 2 activators. Yeah, who's on the cutting edge? Yeah, I am on the cutting edge. And if you take protandum, you're on the cutting edge. So why don't you ask your drug doctor or any health professional, why aren't they on the cutting edge? Why are they basically doing nothing for that? Uh, Nerve 2 could, uh, could be a novel target for COPD prevention therapies. This was medical news today. Once again, these are, these are medical drug you know, uh, e-blasts e, e that go out there. Um, and what it says, NERV2 is, works on the master genes. So we actually get into genetic engineering. This isn't what I'm saying. This is what the top scientists in the world are saying. So why don't you, once again, take charge and at least take something that actually has some benefit from you instead of taking those other things. Another study from American Journal of Respiratory Critical Care Medicine. Oh, that's right. That's another medical drug journal. What do they say? Is that oxidative and anti uh, oxidant and antioxidant imbalances in blood causes asthma, COPD, and for smoking problems. So if you want to, once again, prevent the imbalance, NERV2, protanum is that. Uh, this is another uh, article from the American Journal of Respiratory Critical Care Medicine again. Our study shows that free radical production is increased in patients with COPD and is, is an interest in terms of future treatments. Once again, these are drug doctors. These are, once again, this is from, this is only from Italy. You know, granted, they're not uh, totally uh, sold out by the drug companies. But that just shows you scientists around the world understand the importance of oxidative stress. So by taking protandum, you're getting lots of benefits, over 200 diseases. Once again, no claims can be made. Thank you, FDA. Uh, because, you know, this is able to reduce it and help with all kinds of problems. So regardless of what you have or as we've, we've had, uh, you know, we'll be doing some more videos with Gary Brown, who we've gone the other way. You know, here's a 60-year-old uh, man who's actually outperforming uh, Navy SEALs requirements to become a thing. That's where I really like to talk about, not the diseases, but unfortunately, everybody's so sick out there and on drugs with no benefit, we always have to focus on it. That's really the excitement there is advancement in terms of increased vitality, stamina, strength in terms of, once again, being proactive, preventing things from happening, and making you, because if you're 50, 60, 70, 80 years old, make you feel 30 years younger. And that's what really the excitement is, and that's what Protanum can do for you. Have a nice week.